Hi students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. Today we are starting our way grade B course, the 2018 version. So let's start with the exam pattern and how we are going to teach you. So there are two, uh, three phases. The phase one, in the phase one there are four subjects, quantitative aptitude, reasoning, English language and general awareness. It is a 200 marks paper and it is all objective. So there is QT of 30 marks, reasoning 60 marks, English again 30 marks and GA or general awareness it's of 80 marks. So total 200 marks 120 minutes. So if I summarize the exam pattern, the QT part is same as IBPS PO or SBA PO exam. This section is same as the quantitative aptitude section of IBPS PO or SBA PO. The exam level is same, the difficulty level is almost same. You will find the similar data interpretation questions are uh, 10 to 15 data interpretation questions, two sets, then quadratic equations, number series. Uh, Similarly, time and work, time and distance, these type of questions in there. So in last year, if we talk about last year and uh, previous two years, the there were five questions from inequalities, 15 questions from data interpretation, then simple and compound interest, time and work, mixtures, profit and loss, these type of questions were there. Out of uh, 30, 10 were DI, and then inequalities, five marks were inequalities, Then quadratic equation series and all, all those questions, you know, quadratic equations, you can say quadratic equations, series, so this is not a fixed pattern, maybe next year you won't find quadratic equation, maybe you won't find the inequality. So this can happen then there is time and work, time and distance, mixtures, allegation. So these kind of questions are there. The total they are 30 marks. So that's the quantitative aptitude syllabus. So let's talk about the reasoning part. So how to prepare for the quantitative aptitude section? If you have any book for the IBPS PO exam or the SBI PO exam and you have already gone through that book, you don't need any other book. That is the uh, most important part for you. In the whole preparation, according to me, if you are already preparing for IBPS PO or SBI PO, the general awareness section is the only thing where you need to work. This is the only part. In the QT, reasoning and English, this part is same as SBI PO or IBPS PO. General awareness part is somewhat different. We'll talk in depth about the general awareness section within few minutes. So let's talk about the reasoning part. There are 60 questions are asked in that, uh, that <clears throat> reasoning. So the similarly in the reasoning, there will be questions from puzzles. There will be puzzles, data sufficiency, DS. Then you can say there will be problems based on ages, blood relations, all those blood relations, direction sense test. So four to five marks from these topics, then four, maybe zero to five to this, 15 to 20 to this, up to five to this. Then you, you may find the machine input output, input output, very easy chapter. Then, uh, there will be Scilog, again inequalities, Scilogs, Scilogism, inequalities, 5A marks each. Uh, then uh, logical reasoning will be there. So that's how 60 marks are made up of. That's all. That's all for this reasoning part. How to prepare for it? I already told you that you don't need any a new book just follow the basics right uh, not just the basic if you are already preparing for the SBAP or IBPSPO exam uh, you don't need any new book 
if if you are looking for any book a good book for the preparation you are looking for a workbook go to bankexamstoday.com you can find quantitative aptitude made easy and reasoning made easy perfect book uh, team bank exams today had made it uh, in last 2 years with the rigorous efforts we made these two books so in the english part again there will be reading comprehensions double fillers you know close test maybe there will be a close test error correction parallel jumble so this is the syllabus for the english how to prepare for english read newspapers i mean newspapers is the most important you know aspect or the most important study material for the english section as well as for the general awareness section uh, the which newspaper i recommend i recommend indian express read indian express or the hindu so these are the two newspapers i personally recommend i mean i personally read uh, i personally read indian express but the hindu is also good i mean it is actually better than the indian express but the hindu is not available at my place so if the hindu is available at your place you can follow you can read the hindu otherwise indian express is also good or you can say the business line is also good the economic times is also good do not follow hindustan times or times of india i don't like those newspapers those are really commercial newspapers so that's all for the general awareness uh, english section for the general awareness section again uh, see there is some difference between the general awareness section of ibps po sba po and rba grade b i'm talking about phase 1 in the ibps po there will be questions about current affairs previous 5 or 6 months current affairs countries and their capitals basic banking terms you know basic static gk or these are the basic questions so if we talk about the ibps po exam there will be questions about the awards and honors history of banking so list of important days these are some important <coughs> topics of ga so <coughs> i won't you know discuss much about that let's discuss about the ga of rba grade b you need to read whatever you have got for ibps po if you are reading gk digest monthly gk digest keep reading it i mean for rba grade b there are few extra things that you need to do first one follow official rba website rbi dot org i think that is dot in maybe that is a uh, url of the official rbi website uh, that is out of frame i think uh, follow official rbi website just search it in the top menu there i think in the rbi's website in the top menu there is a, a menu item named as notices notices notification just go through that daily daily there are two or three notifications is the rbi website that is the best source of you know banking awareness banking awareness topics or the financial awareness topic that that is a most important part whatever you are doing for ibps po do that plus follow the rbi website just go through the about us page of sebi nabard uh, national housing bank just go through their you know uh, go to their websites and just check their about us page or check their notification these are the two three websites that i follow that is this is the most important one Uh, check the nhb uh, national housing bank or nabard then there is sebi irda just follow their official websites one follow the rbi's official website every day and these websites once in a week that is enough so this is the most important for, part for the rbi grade b preparation uh, further this will help you in that uh, uh, social and economic that esi uh, uh, paper that paper 2 of the phase 2 exam that is economic and social issues esi paper these things are going to help you in that paper also right so this is the step 1 the actually step 2 the step 1 was read the monthly gk digest the second one is follow the official websites of rbi sebi irda and all those you know financial organizations these are the two steps the third step what i would recommend is read newspapers i mean this is this is what everybody you know recommend newspapers i have already recommended for english but read newspaper every day this is my recommendation and what else you can do is we actually prepare notes uh, we prepare notes for the 
जनरल अवेयरनेस एंड बैंकिंग अवेयरनेस सेक्शन डाउनलोड नोट्स डाउनलोड बैंकिंग मंथली बैंकिंग अवेयरनेस अवेयरनेस कैप्स्यूल फ्रॉम बैंक एग्जाम्स टुडे ओके फ्रॉम बैंक एग्जाम्स टुडे दिस इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट सो दीज आर द फोर थिंग्स द फोर यू नो सोर्सेज ऑफ स्टडी मटीरियल दैट आई रिकमेंड फॉर जनरल अवेयरनेस सेक्शन एंड दैट सेट Uh, further if you have an android phone install bank exams today's android application that will be very useful for you the bank exams today's official android application so let's move on to the phase 2 part so we will conduct one to one live session we'll having a whatsapp group we'll add you in our whatsapp group so join the course the link to join the course will be available in the description so let's move on to the phase 2 part in the phase 2 there are three papers there are basically three papers the paper 1 is english their paper 1 is english paper 2 is economic and social issues what we short name is esi and third one is finance and management these are three papers time allotted is 90 minutes each 90 minutes each and 100 marks are allotted to them 100 marks to each of these papers so this is the second phase so let's first of all talk about finance and management that is my forte that's what i am going to teach you in the rba grade b course so students if uh, any any more anybody out of you have already registered for you know rb grade b course last year we are not going to charge a single penny you know you can just drop me an email i'll add you to the course no problem at all so let's talk about finance and management fm 60% of the paper will be out of finance and 40% from management and first of all we'll talk about this management thing very easy this 40% paper is very easy just pick any management book the principles of management book uh you can follow the plus one book uh, plus one business studies book of cbsc or any the state board for uh, in which principles of management is a part that will be sufficient for this portion 40% basically the question will be asked basically from uh, the leadership chapters that uh, types of le leadership strategies the leadership theories and the motivation the managerial theories the history of management what is scientific management the communication the basic topics you know uh, first of all the important topics is if i talk about the 14 principles of management principles of management then the history and techniques of management history and techniques of management the xy technique and that you know uh scientific management all those techniques the management models the bcg model the potter model very important then the leadership chapter is very important leadership most of the questions will be asked from leadership chapter or motivation you know motivational theories then the communication chapter so these are the important chapters these are the you know very important chapter models are you know scattered all around that the principles of management book history and techniques this this is uh, mostly the first or the second chapter of the book so we are going to start with that uh, history of history of the management right and we'll start with the various managerial techniques management techniques so we are going to start the classes by tomorrow by monday right so join the classes so this is the 40% of the part that is from management if you have the basic uh, principles of management book from igno that is the best thing right or even you can download our simple principles of management notes available on bankexamstudy.com and available on rbi grade b course you know so you can download it from there so let's talk about the 60% finance part so uh, there will be 15 to 20 questions uh, numerical questions out of the 60 uh, 60 questions Uh, 15 to 20 questions will be from numericals mostly the questions will be asked from you know financial statement analysis financial statement analysis 
रेशियो एनालिसिस वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रेशियो एनालिसिस आई हैव ऑलरेडी डन फ्यू वीडियोज ऑन रेशियो एनालिसिस प्लीज चेक द वीडियोज फ्रॉम लर्न डॉट बैंक एग्जाम स्टडे डॉट कॉम द लिंक विल बी अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन प्लीज चेक इट द कैश फ्लो स्टेटमेंट फंड फ्लो स्टेटमेंट कैश फ्लो और द बेसिक यू कैन से बॉन्ड प्राइसिंग यू नो बॉन्ड दी वन एंड वन वन क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम बॉन्ड प्राइसिंग वाई टी एम आई आर आर एन पी वी कॉस्ट ऑफ कैपिटल कैपिटल स्ट्रक्चर कैपिटल स्ट्रक्चर एंड बेसिक ऑफ बेसिक्स ऑफ कंपनी अकाउंट सो दीज आर फ्यू इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट आर बी ए ग्रेट बी एफ एम दीज आर द फ्यू इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स फॉर नोमेरिकल्स जस्ट फिफ्टीन लास्ट ईयर फिफ्टीन क्वेश्चन वर आज फ्रॉम द नोमेरिकल सो मे बी दिस ईयर फिफ्टीन टू ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन बी आज फ्रॉम नोमेरिकल एंड दीज आर द सम इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स फॉर नोमेरिकल्स सो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द थ्रेटिकल पार्ट द इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट एक्चुअली सो The whole syllabus, the theoretical syllabus is divided into three parts as per the official RBI notification. The financial system, financial markets, and general topics. In the financial systems, uh, you need to read about the regulators, uh, regulators of banks. I already, you know, uh, told you that you need to follow the official RBI website. That is the first important thing you need to do. Follow the official RBI website. Follow the official SIDB, Exim, NABARD, NHB. So I'm I'm listing down the various you know website that you need to follow the RBI, the SIDB, Exim, NABARD, National Housing Bank, SEB. and you can said we is done exam so these are the few important official websites that you need to follow just just check their about us page that is the first thing you need to do then please check their notifications page they have all of them have a notices page just once in a week or you can say twice a week please check the notices of these important organizations so this is the most important part for the preparation of this finance and even that esi paper very important then just read the basic banking terms and go in depth about those terms right then you need to read about uh, primary and secondary market the financial market forex bonds equities various financial instruments and recent developments in the financial environment financial industry so then there are general topics so the general topics it is a very wide actually syllabus if we we call it general topics and all the general financial topics the risk management derivatives banking update financial inclusion whatever that is related to money or finance is a part of general topics so if you are already following any you know financially mobile app or financial you know newspaper that that part it will be covered so management ka i have already covered and the, let's talk about esi economic and social issues a lot of students are all very confused about esi what to read for esi paper so let's talk about what to read about esi paper right kya padhna kya chahiye esi ke paper ke bare mein esi ka paper right so the first thing that you need to follow is current affairs ye main already bata chuka hu the current affairs you need to follow right प्रीवियस सिक्स मंथ्स का करंट अफेयर्स इज अनफ सिक्स मंथ्स का करंट अफेयर्स इज अनफ सो हाउ टू रीड द करंट अफेयर्स दैट इज अ मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट कैसे पढ़ना करंट अफेयर्स को फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट रीड द न्यूज पेपर एवरी डे राइट यू विल गेट गेट द बेसिक्स क्या क्या हो रहा है पूरी मार्केट में मतलब रीड द बेसिक हेडलाइंस देन इफ इफ दैट पर्टिकुलर आर्टिकल इज इंटरेस्टिंग टू यू आर रिलेटेड टू बैंकिंग इंडस्ट्री और फाइनेंशियल इंडस्ट्री गो थ्रू इट डीप में घुस के पढ़ो उसको देन देर इज एडिटोरियल पार्ट यू कैन जस्ट रीड द एडिटोरियल पार्ट ऑल्सो राइट देन इफ यू हैव ऑलरेडी इंस्टॉल द बैंक एग्जाम टूडे एप्लीकेशन वी आर यू नो प्रोवाइडिंग द इंटरप्रिटेशन ऑफ द करंट अफेयर्स एवरी डे 
just go through it right that will be sufficient the current affairs official websites i have already told you about the official websites follow those official websites very important then the government schemes the government government is launching a lot of schemes and you need to read about those schemes jaise ki abhi as of now the mudra scheme is very popular you need to read about what is mudra scheme how to get the mudra loan i mean who is eligible for it i mean who is not eligible who is eligible tenure kya hota hai what is a tenure and then various other policies sukanya samriddhi yojana what is sukanya samriddhi yojana uh, what is it it meant for all the also read about the state level schemes it is also very important punjab mein kaun sa scheme hai haryana mein kaun sa scheme hai himachal mein kaun sa scheme hai maharashtra mein koi scheme aa raha hai just read about it so read about the various government schemes a lot a lot of good study material is available online not even on bank exams today murunal murunal.org we shouldn't talk about our competitors but it is also a great website there are many other good websites available online actually stay updated uh, online as well as if you are reading the newspaper you will get to know about more and more about the government schemes so that is also an important part then read about the economic survey इकोनॉमिक सर्वे एंड बजट इकोनॉमिक सर्वे बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है यूनियन बजट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो वट एवर द रिपोर्ट पब्लिश बाय द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया और आरबीआई दीज आर इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द एग्जाम सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर द ई एस आई पेपर वी आर गोइंग टू टीच सो दिस पार्ट ऑल्सो सो वी हैव अ स्पेशलिस्ट टीचर फॉर ई एस आई पेपर सो स्टे अपडेटेड एंड ज्वाइन आर कोर्स द आर बी आई ग्रेड बी कोर्स So let's talk about the English. Although I'm not going to teach the English paper, I'm I'm not an English teacher. But last year there were three questions: the first one from essay writing, the second one from the reading comprehension, and the third one from precise writing. The essay was on the the topics of essay was uh, impact of GST. Then the farmer suicide was a topic. Then the impact of technology over building smart cities. So these were the simple topics. I'm not. Uh, i'm not going to go in depth about english because i'm not an english teacher uh, there will be another session on english so if you like this video uh, and if you like the content of bankexamstoday.com if you like the videos of bankexamstoday.com and if you like our mobile application and if you like our teaching methodology if you like our teaching methods if you like our notes just join our course the rbi grade b course this is my personal number if you you know want to contact and inquire about the rbi grade b course you can call me here right or the link to join link to join the course is available in the description right just join the course so that's all for today uh, have a nice day you can call me anytime thank you and have a nice day bye